Hey everyone, it's Ashley Gilligan, Independent Manager with Pink Zebra, and today I have a Dollar Tree haul for you. Everything I purchased at the Dollar Tree um, was stuff that I could use for my Pink Zebra business, and you guys know that I love to share my ideas and the finds that I find for my Pink Zebra business, so here I am. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and jump right into this. So the first thing that I found were these cute little wire round baskets, obviously just a dollar at the Dollar Tree, and what I plan to use... Um, these four is the little gift baskets. I made a video um, on this actually right before this video, so that's going to be going up before this one, so it should already be on my channel by now. But that's what I used um, for this gift basket, and I just really like the size of it, and I like that it's round, and everything fits in there nicely. Um, and then inside the gift basket, I got the little um, decorative shred paper, and that's just hot pink. I also purchased some white, and I have some light pink, and again, that's only a dollar. Um, and then to wrap my gift baskets up in, I found, like, this was really exciting to me, um, these two-pack of basket bags. And it comes with the little twisty tie um, to kind of wrap it up, and it shows you, you know, everything on the side. Um, it's pretty self-explanatory, so it cracks me up that there's actually instructions how to use this. Um, but I thought these were perfect because a lot of times I will buy the cellophane on the roll, kind of like wrapping paper, and it's just a pain in the rear. So these are perfect. They're just bags that you can just slip it down into and tie it off with a ribbon and twine or whatever, and you're good to go. Um, third thing is, this isn't something that I purchased recently, but it does come from the Dollar Tree, and they're these little cute... Um, candle holders. Now I know that this is not really a Pink Zebra approved um, candle holder, but they do fit the essential glass candles really nicely, so I figured that I would just mention it in this video. Um, I don't see any reason why we shouldn't use this, to be quite honest, because it is just metal and it does hold the candle. Um, but also another cute touch is um, it just makes a really great like little decoration if you wanted to wrap this up in like a goodie bag or something or cellophane. Um, it just looks nice to present the sprinkles that way. So that came from the Dollar Tree. Um, I actually didn't purchase it. I actually bought a bunch of them from a consultant that resigned that used them for the purpose that I just told you. So there's that. Um, excuse me. The third thing I bought, which I was really excited about, $4, is this little wire um, like mesh or whatever you want to call it. Um, business card holder and I thought how perfect is this going to be for home parties or for events and stuff where I can just sit this on the table um, I normally just have business cards sitting out in random spots on my tables but this is great because then I could just have it um, in one little spot and people can easily say hey there's her business cards and take one um, next you can also purchase the sachet bags um, in the wedding or baby shower aisle at the Dollar Tree and you know these are great for um, sprinkles to toss in the sock drawer, linen closets, or whatever. So you can get, I believe it's a six pack of the little sachet bags. Next is obviously a necessity. It is a Sharpie um, fine marker. Only a dollar. Um, I don't know how much these are at like Walmart and stuff, but I can't imagine it would be only a dollar. I think it would be like a dollar something. So I picked up, I think, three or four of these. I'm always using these. Um, these are actually what I use to do a lot of the labels on my jars. Um, so had to get those and then I actually bought three or four of the packs of the basket bags. So there's more of those. Um, next I bought invisible tape just because I always need tape for something and just for a dollar I think it'll do. Um, and then next I got a couple packs of these, um, clasp envelopes. Now these aren't the prettiest envelopes and they're definitely not my favorite, um, you know, to look at. They're not that pretty, but these are perfect to just slip a catalog and some samples if you have somebody requesting it. And six for a dollar, you can't go wrong with that. So I will deal with the ugly yellow um, of that folder. And then last but not least, I bought this pack of 40 loot sacks. They're just the little loot bags that you would usually see at like a kid's birthday party for, um, you know, little treats and prizes and stuff. These are actually really small. I think it's like a four by six bag. Um, and the reason why I bought these was to slip, where did my other candle go? I bought it to slip the candles from my little gift bags into, but as you can see here, it's just too short and there's not enough slack up here to actually tie it off. So I thought of this idea, um, which I think is going to be pretty neat for events and stuff to use them to hold a business card and a sample. That way, if somebody comes up to my table and requests a sample or I see that they're kind of interested, but they don't make a purchase, I can just hand them one of these little goodie bags. Um, and the presentation of it is really cute. 
And instead of, you know, stapling the sample to my business card and running the business card, I figured this was a lot easier. So that's everything I got from the Dollar Tree recently. Um, comment below and tell me what you use for your direct sales business from the Dollar Tree. I'd love to know. Um, as you already know, when you are running a direct sales business and when you are doing your own business, um, it takes money to make money. So all this stuff here is tax deductible. I'm going to save all the receipts um, from this purchase. And then for next year's taxes, I'm going to be able to claim that as a deduction. So don't forget to save your receipts. And I hope you guys like this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Make sure to hit the subscribe button if you are new. And I will see you guys in my next video. I've got a lot of really great ideas coming up. So keep an eye out for those videos. Thank you guys for watching. I know we'll talk to you guys later. Bye.